been at Cobo Hall all morning long for the Pro Football Hall of Fame tour. It's taking place there this weekend. And now we're getting a special look as All Star James Lofton is presented with a new Hall of Fame ring. Pretty cool. Seven Action News reporter Mike Wolfolk joins us live now with this big deal. Hey there, Mike. Good morning and new and Brianne. Yeah, this is quite an honor, I would say, for me as a football fan to be involved in this special ceremony. But as you know, the uh, Hall of Fame is presenting new rings to all of the enshrinees. And James Lofton, the legend, uh, former Packer, Bill, Raider, sure, you've, yeah. you've been everywhere, is now about to receive his ring. So I'm going to turn this over to, uh, to David Baker, who's president of the Hall of Fame. David? Great. Thank you, Mike. Um, James, the mission of the Pro Football Hall of Fame is to honor the heroes of the game, and you are certainly that. Thank you. Uh, to preserve its history, to promote the values of the game, and you stand for that, and to celebrate excellence everywhere. So we're excited to be here today uh, at the Honor of the Heroes Tour here in Detroit to celebrate your excellence. Um, you know, Mike, each Hall of Famer receives three icons, a bus that'll last 40,000 years in Canton, Ohio, a gold jacket, that only Hall of Famers wear, and a ring of excellence um, that is generally given in front of their stadium and their fans. But because of James' schedule, we wanted to do it today here at the Honor of the Heroes Tour. It's a great reminder that the great stadiums that we have today, uh, the great games that are on our networks now, um, the great teams we have, the great league, and the great game itself is built on the shoulders of men like this. Um, James, on behalf of the Pro Football Hall of Fame and your 294 other Hall of Famers who are the best of all time, it's my privilege to give you this ring of excellence that's designed by Kate Jewelers uh, for you and Beverly to have forever. Thank you, James. Well, well thank you, David. And, um, you know, it's incredible. We, this is the second ring that I've received. The first one was when, back in 2003, my entire family was with me. We were at Lambeau Field. So what better place to be than in part of the old NFC Central in Detroit? I, I almost still refer to it like that. Uh, for all the guys, the black and blue division, for all the guys that I, I played with, that I played against, this is a testament to how much fun we had playing the game and how proud we are, whether we stepped on the field once or whether we stepped on the field for 200 Sundays, how proud we are of being a part of the National Football League and more so, to be a member of the Pro Football Hall of Fame is certainly special and something that I regard very highly. And uh, every day I kind of pinch myself, and I can't believe it's me, the skinny high school quarterback right. from George Washington High School in Los Angeles. Mr. Lofton, it's a pleasure to meet you. Congratulations again. And uh, thank you, uh, Mr. Baker, for letting us be a part of this special ceremony, this special moment. Thank you, Mike. Folks, the uh, Hall special tour here at Cobo today, 11 to 6, tomorrow, same hours. 25 bucks. It's well worth every penny. Back to you guys in the studio. Wow, what a moment. Yeah, very right? cool. Very exciting. Congratulations to him. That is, as we said, some very nice hardware there and very well deserved. All right. It